Now, you could, my thing is, you could say that. Yeah. My, 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 my thing is, is, look, we have some people, we have some names, right? Mm-hmm. We have Shanks, mm-hmm. we have Rayleigh, we have Dragon, you know, there's a possible Mihawk, maybe, perhaps, I don't know. Um, I definitely believe Marco and company. Are Mar- Marco, is, Marco is definitely going to be there, I feel like. Marco and Whitebeard, folks. Now, yeah. I feel like we should... Do we think that these characters are some of these characters are top ten, top ten, top fifteen? We're replacing them. Who in, are we in, talking about? Let's start off with Rayleigh. Do you believe Rayleigh is top ten? Yeah. Because top ten, you believe he's top ten. If you're Vice Admiral King of Pirates, you're top ten one piece. Mm-hmm. Yes. What are you mm-hmm. saying, Chris? Mm-hmm. <laughs> okay, okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Watch this. We are, we are going. Listen, we're gonna go on. To respect our seniors, our elders, and everything, but like we gotta go down the list first, okay? Like, because I gotta be generous to everybody that's out there. Another name that we threw out was Mihawk. Yes. Mm-hmm. Like it's oh, yeah. it's Wano. Yeah. <laughs> I think Mihawk has to be there. Yeah. I feel like he's he's sort of like, sort of, mm-hmm. I feel like he has to be there. Mm-hmm. So. But is that enough? I don't. I don't think that's enough. Mm-hmm. But um, if Mihawk can see Shanks, he could probably see a big mouth. No. Yeah, but it's not gonna be enough though. Mm. Not I mean, just, it's only gonna be him and Perona. It'll be a good asset. Perona's right, 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 right. I'm not so, sure. So who we got? We got Perona can have the little people. <laughs> let's, 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 we should break it down in a way where, let's say, if we have Rayleigh Perona, right? Mm-hmm. Um, is Rayleigh going to be enough to hang with Big Mom? Stop. Can Rayleigh beat Big Mom? Is my question to you guys. I mean, I, mm. it's tough. I don't want to say he'll lose, but prime, beats? prime Rayleigh. Absolutely, I absolutely. That. But now, right now, I, I can't. Say. I don't think. Uh, I don't know if he's gonna uh-oh. win. I don't know if he's gonna win. I don't know if he's gonna lose either, though. Big Mom is a Big Mom is arguably the most sturdiest character in one. Like, how do you how do you defeat that? Whoa! Okay, whoa, wait, whoa, okay, whoa, wait, whoa, wait, wait, wait. Okay, Big Mom's the, more sturdy than Kaido, who jumped out the sky and landed on his head and got drowned, up? bro. And he has a devil. For <laughs> Kaido fell out the sky. The sky. The, he's a big. Right. <laughs> she literally defied the rules of One Piece wait, and wait, said, wait. "I'm gonna drown in the ocean and survive." Bro, she Yo, fell okay, in the water. I, I hear that. I hear that. Listen, <laughs> whole cake. Wait, wait, whole cake island. The the arc made Big Mom look bad. Yes, <laughs> it, it just it, it made did. her look bad. But she, it's like she is not like like when we were watching that arc it's like at points we forgot she was yonko like because mm-hmm. right. they was just playing around and running around and doing like whatever they wanted yeah. and everything but and it's she, like yeah. if she were to get serious and in her right mind in her right mind yeah. and if she was serious like luffy would be dead they will all be dead yeah. you know what i'm saying nami would like yeah it, it just fell into I, line i, I said she was I'm sorry, the most sturdy is just because the fact that they were on, they were looking for an opportunity to find out if she could even bleed. You know what I mean? Right. While Kaido, I mean, he's thirty, but I mean, Luffy did him a couple of elephant guts and he laid down. You Kaido was saying? drunk. The man wasn't <laughs> the even man, in the right. He blew up here, but that's always drunk. But he yeah. blew up a mountain while he wasn't even in his right mind. Imagine <laughs> if he's imagine he's sober and ready to go. Who's yeah. fighting Kaido? I just think that. I just think that if we go know, top three most powerful alive right now, Jack. I, I'm not talking about strength wise. I just feel that when you said. Big Mom versus Rayleigh, I said Big Mom's biggest feat mm-hmm. is she is sturdy. She's very just like, the problem they've always had with Big Mom is just even injuring her. You know what I'm saying? Like, even Kaido has 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 injuries. When his explanation, when they brought him into was, he has X amount of stab wounds, or not stab wounds, but he's been hung and this, that, and the third. He's right. sturdy, but Big Mom, we don't, like, as a child, like, that, that, it's hard for her to damage and, and that's amazing. But if I'm taking Roger's right-hand man, you don't think he has any knowledge of a way mind. to damage Big Mom? <clears throat> I mean... Whitebeard was old too. It almost thing. destroyed Marine Yes, Ford. if there's a way, yes. But his pure strength right now, not in his prime, chilling, relaxed, retired. I don't know if he's, I don't know if he's necessarily, you know, giving Big Mom the, the, the one-two combo. You know what I mean? It's tough. I, I mean, don't think he'll lose, though. I, he'll hold his own. I don't know about winning. 100%. Because we have Big Mom. She's basically almost in our prime now. She's like, or at least towards the end of her prime. Versus Rayleigh, who's out of his prime. He's going to hold up. Rayleigh is like right-hand man of Roger. We can't say he's not going to hold up. He might get some hits in. He might injure Big Mom. Okay. 100%. 
but winning the fight totally, I have to give it to Big Mom with like some great level of difficulty, if anything. Okay, so it really doesn't work for you guys. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's go with the case. Mm -hmm. Shanks arrives. What no, do we say? Different case. I think Shanks. I think Shanks yeah, can defeat both of them one on one. Yeah. Okay. So you think Shanks is stronger than Kaido? I, I think I Shanks do. is stronger than than Rayleigh. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's so quick. Wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> I, heard that. Yeah, I, heard that. I I think Shanks, Shanks is stronger than Rayleigh. Yo. All right. Mm. I think he's stronger than Kaido just for the clash of white. That's why I think. I think. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, Jay. Okay, why? Go ahead, go ahead, Kurt. Okay, go ahead, wait, 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 wait. I was gonna say, listen, listen, you got it. I used to be of that camp, okay, in that mindset, but he did not clash with no white beard, okay. That wasn't no clash with white beard in, mm. in, in my eyes, so okay. What was it? That was just a show <laughs> of a force. Like I'm here, all right. Yeah. Like this is this is why. Listen, if white beard, prime white beard, Shanks would be a memory. All right, I believe that. I Prime believe that. White Beard, Shanks would be a memory, right? Absolutely. And even in later age, like White Beard was not being serious in the least. Like he was not. My man got out of his seat with all the. <laughs> like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, it was like yeah. this is this is just for show, mm -hmm. right? Like you know what I'm saying. So that was like an elevation of of Shanks that was not actual reality of his strength. Mm -hmm. He is strong, but he was not White Beard. Okay, mm -hmm. but he's also not Kaido. I think he could he could beat Big Mom. Mm -hmm. I think that's where I think that's where I would I would put it. Kaido, Shanks, Big Mom. Okay, mm -hmm. but I agree with that. I don't think he he doing I, nothing. He not. I, I agree with that. I don't know if he's seeing Kaido. He's not seeing Kaido um, right now. Mm -hmm. I do think he would he would best Big Mom though for sure. I I look at Shanks. I don't know. Just if I was comparing the older cat, I look at him more of like a red. You know what I'm saying? Like if Rayleigh was in his prime, that's how I look at Shanks. So I look at like. But 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 but. Oh, that's didn't, didn't you? <laughs> wait wait hold on wait. What were you gonna say? And I I, just, I said it. You Why? said it was disrespectful. Oh yeah. Why do you feel that way? Disrespectful to who? Disrespectful to Rayleigh. Hmm. To be like Rayleigh in his prime was Shanks. I don't think that's far off the mark. I don't know. I didn't say he was Gold Roger. But I said he was close. I think he's close to Rayleigh. Like, he's like, Rayleigh, Rayleigh. He said Rayleigh in his prime with Shanks? He said, he said, Ray, he said, I said Rayleigh, Rayleigh in his prime. prime. Is, I say it's the most comparable to Shanks in one of I mean, I can hear that based on this hockey and the swordmanship and like how they both fight, they kind of fight they similar. They were the same crew. He was his master. They kind of fight similar. Rayleigh trained Shanks. I, I get that, the similarities. Mm -hmm. But he but said <laughs> that Rayleigh in his prime was <laughs> Shanks. Like Shanks level, correct? Uh-huh. Like where Shanks is right now, he's Yonko. Mm -hmm. Like his nah, he was stronger than Shanks in his prime. That's, that's mm -hmm. what I'm. Yeah, I he agree was with that. He was stronger I, than I Shanks. I could say he's stronger. Okay, he was stronger. He was stronger, but I would but the say, similarities. I would say, yeah. I would say, Shanks is like even strength wise. Yeah. So you're saying Rayleigh in his prime is is pretty much wiping everybody that's on the field right now. Big no, white people, white people. But I'm but I'm saying I'm saying Rayleigh in his prime is you're saying is stronger than Kaido. I believe so. Yes. Well then, I don't think we should believe that. Sh well, that's why I said you're, you're Roger's right hand. I mean, oh. we tech. I mean, technically, Whitebeard was stronger than Roger. Technically. Hold on, hold on, talk about, talk about, talk about. Listen, listen. Let's not let it finish. Let it finish. We we were we saw when um. I forgot. You telling me a new thing? I didn't <laughs> educate me, Jeff. <laughs> when when they had the flashback of Whitebeard and Gold Roger drinking sake, mm -hmm. I believe Roger told Whitebeard, "Oh, if you want me to hand you the title of Pirate King, I can Pirate do that King, for I you. I can do it for you." I'm sorry. I thought that I believe there was a moment. <laughs> oh, I believe there was a moment where. <laughs> But I mean, Whitebeard was known as the strongest man in the world, even when Roger was king of the pirates. There was one person that Whitebeard couldn't defeat in the world, and that is none other than Gold D. Roger, is that really the pirate king. I don't think Whitebeard was seeing Roger. Everybody else on the map, absolutely. But Roger was just in a different bracket, which is why I feel like he was sitting at the top. They were rivals, and Whitebeard was very, very close. And that's why once Roger passed away, Mm -hmm. Whitebeard was in that position. 
Um, I, I always just it was his number I always two. just remember and, two and I do apologize for my facts wrong. But I always do just remember Whitebeard being referenced as a stronger pirate be, but didn't want to go after the One Piece and that's why he wasn't king. Not because he couldn't beat Roger. But I think that was after. Yeah, I think that was, was after, after. That was after. That was when after. Roger died, he never yeah. really like Not pursued. Stay. <laughs> yeah. Anime Sunday. He just kept up. Check him out. The professional. <laughs> he got the symbolism <laughs> of <laughs> being like he's like the gatekeeper almost. But that, like I think that's that's why because we I would have these these uh debates with Robert like and talk about Whitebeard and the ranking. Mm-hmm. But I, that was his stance like the whole time was basically like after Roger. Okay, Whitebeard was yeah. the strongest pirate, the Absolutely. greatest pirate. Yeah. But he just chose not to seek after um, One, Piece. Uh, One Piece and, and call himself the Pirate King, like the new Pirate King. Yeah. He just, you know, his generation passed along with Roger. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I think that's kind of what it, it was. Like his okay. loyalty to him and as right. a rival. Yeah. Okay. Once he passed, it was like my generation passed, so I'm no longer going to, yeah. you know, okay. fight for that title. But it was it was all to my point that. Um, where I was putting Rayleigh in terms of Shanks, Whitebeard. I mean, I think they're pretty close. Shanks and Rayleigh. Prime. Right, so if we did the top three in li- or live in One Piece right now, I'm just letting you guys know I'm taking Kaido at number one. Okay. Um, if, we, if we're not counting Eam, by the way, we're not counting Eam, right? Yeah. But I'm going to take Kaido at number one. I'm going to take Shanks at number two. And I'm going to put Monkey D. Dragon at number oh. three. Oh, oh my god. I was about to say, what are you doing? Hold on, hold on. 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 A loopy when it comes to like the fighting and like the you know whole surpassing next level type stuff i feel like if it came down to you know the good old fight for your friends and the fight against the big monster i feel like shanks will make it on top or he'll find a way you yeah. know I mean? that's why i look at it like am i gonna say that shanks can't beat kaido i feel like if it was down to the last wire i think he could. i feel like you can injure him too because kaido does have a you know a little slash on his belly Kaido has taken some blows, apparently. Someone uh, has injured him a with a sword. To so if the hockey is strong enough, I'm just saying, he could injure him. I don't know if he's stronger than Kaido, though. I can't really say that.